Hey guys, it's Heather from Calva Plan, and in today's video, I am planning for the week of September 23rd through the 29th in my dashboard planner. We do have a release this week, and normally I like to use the stickers that we're releasing, but we're releasing Christmas, and I'm just not not quite ready <laughs> to have Christmas in my planner, although I'm super excited about our Christmas um, stickers and all the goodies that we'll be releasing. I'm just not quite ready <laughs> to go that far in my planner. So we are going to start, I'm using um, Watercolor Boxes and Florals Volume 3. This is one of my favorite sticker books I've ever designed. I'm obsessed with it. And I'm going to be pairing it with Dashboard Basics and Alpha Basics. So I'm gonna start, I'm trying to decide, do I wanna go blue or purple? I was gonna do blue, but now I think I wanna do purple. So I'm gonna start by taking these long sidebar stickers. These are technically sized to go this way in a vertical planner, but sometimes I like to take them and go up the side in my dashboard and let this just be like a whole decorative side. And then I'm gonna come and take the second one and do the same thing. We're gonna line it up. Oops. Let's line it up so that it's straight. And then I'm gonna take my X-Acto knife. So this is, and it's actually a craft knife, sorry. X-Acto is a brand. And I'm going to just cut it. right along the side like that. And then I'm actually, I'm gonna grab these. These are a little sneak peek for you guys. These are little scissors we're gonna be releasing later this year. Um, so stay tuned for that. But they're just little miniature scissors. And I didn't put this floral exactly straight. So I'm just gonna use these little mini scissors real fast just to trim off that little sticker and then you can you close it and you put it back in here it's like little scissors on the go that is like a major sneak peek because those do not release until december um all right so now that i've done that over here i'm going to come to the right side and i'm going to put a sticker right here like this and then I'm gonna go to Dashboard Basics. I wonder if I've already used like, this is kind of like a tealy green. Yeah, that'll be cute. So we're gonna put this one on Wednesday or on Monday, I work on Mondays. And then I'm going to take this one and put it over here like so. Then I'm going to take this big one and put it kind of like this. I love our dashboard and how you can set it up like however you want it to be. That's like my favorite thing. I love setting it up. Then I'm going to take another one of these dashboard stickers. And I'm going to put it over here on Friday. And then I'm going to take this checklist sticker. And I'm going to put it on Tuesday. As I work, I typically work Monday, Tuesday, Friday. So that's kind of what I'm trying to set up over there. And then I'm going to take this purple checklist and let it run like so. Okay, now I'm going to kind of move this to the side. I'm going to come back over here. 
I don't usually work on Saturdays, so I feel pretty okay with putting a floral sticker right here. Um, and then I also don't usually work on Wednesdays. This is usually the day I have to take Amelia to her allergist. So we can put another sticker there. And then I'm gonna put a sticker up here. This purple box, I think it's a, it's like slightly crooked. Oh well, I'm not gonna mess with it. All right, let's go to Alpha Basics and we're gonna go here and we're gonna put I G for Instagram. And then we're gonna put T O D O. And then I'm gonna put some dot stickers down here. And then we're gonna put actually don't think I'm gonna put, I think I'm gonna spell out film. And we're gonna use this box to track all the stuff I need to film for this week. And then this one, I think I'm gonna turn sideways and let it say product. And this will be all the product I either need to design or manufacture or deal with in other ways. All right, then I'm gonna go back to Dashboard Basics. And I'm gonna put some dot stickers down here, tying in some more of that teal, since it's kind of super purple down here with the purple box. All right, that is pretty much done. I may add a few more boxes over here or some quotes, but I'll probably wait and do that until we actually start filling it in for the week. So that is my spread using watercolor boxes and florals volume three. I really love how it turned out. Um, and then I also paired it with dashboard basics and alpha basics. If you like this video, I hope you hit the like button. If you want to see more of my videos, hit that subscribe button and happy planning.